Uh, hi, Dan. Thanks for taking a minute to chat with me today and congratulations on being named to the best lawyers in America 2021 for your appellate and insurance law practice. Thanks, Megan. It's nice to talk to you. Yeah. Um, so I was hoping you could tell me just a little bit about how it is that you help your clients. I help my clients in three ways, primarily. Uh, I'm an appellate lawyer, so many of my clients come to me having lost a case, whether it's a civil case or a criminal case, and look for me to handle their appeal. Generally in the Connecticut Appellate Court, Connecticut Supreme Court, I also do a lot of work in the Second Circuit Court of Appeals in New York City. Um, and so those cases range from tort verdicts to criminal cases, to constitutional cases, divorce cases. Um, my particular skill set that I bring to the table is knowledge of the judges, knowledge of how to effectively make an appellate argument. Um, I've argued over 100 appeals, so that's uh, the main part of my practice. But I do two other things. One is I advise clients during the trial uh, of an underlying case about appellate issues, making sure that the record is properly preserved, helping them properly raise and frame legal issues so that if there is an appeal, they're in the best possible position to win it. Um, appeals are a little bit like uh, a house, and if you don't put in the foundation right, which is the trial, uh, you're not going to be able to have a, a sound, stable building on top of it. Uh, and then I just generally provide advice to clients about complex legal issues. Uh, I'm doing that right now uh, for a couple of clients uh, without formally representing them on appeal. Great, thanks. I appreciated the metaphor as well for appeals. Um, and I'm curious right now with our current environment, is there anything in particular that you want your clients to know in this time of uncertainty? Well, for one thing, I think it's important to know that the Connecticut state courts, especially the public courts, never actually closed. Uh, some things got delayed, but they kept running and are now moving back to full time uh, operations. Mm -hmm. uh, the appellate and Supreme Court are going to start hearing cases live in person. Again, they had done it uh, in May with a web application. Um, so we're slowly moving back towards at least a new normal. I don't know if we'll ever move back to the old normal. Um, but I think the important thing for clients to know is that I'm here and our firm is here. And one of our areas of expertise is helping them navigate uh, challenging complex times. You know, complex legal questions arise whether the world is stable or the world is crazy. Uh, and we're here right now uh, to help clients with that just as we've always been. Wonderful. Thank you very much. My pleasure.